Hey, uh, welcome to another tutorial from our WordPress Page Builders Academy. Uh, we have an extensive library of tutorials for uh, all the top WordPress page builders. So be sure to subscribe and hit that bell so you, you can see them when they come out. Okay, now on to today's tutorial. Have you ever encountered a situation in Elementor where the icons and text appear as large black symbols in the first few seconds of the website load? You are typically dealing with flickers or flash of unstyled content. This issue occurs when the browser initially renders a web page before it has fully downloaded the necessary style sheets or fonts, resulting in a brief moment where the page appears unstyled or incorrectly styled. This can happen particularly if your style sheets or fonts are loaded asynchronously or if there's a delay in fetching them from the server. A possible cause of that issue is loading delays and the embedding of template style sheets in the footer rather than the header. You can solve this issue by using one of the following methods. Define the CSS print method to inline instead of using external files. You can do this by going to Elementor. Settings. Advanced. CSS print method. Internal embedding. Load the CSS files with an action in the functions BHP file of your child theme. Hey, we've got a quick favor to ask. If you've made it this far into my tutorial, please smash the like button. It will really help out this channel and these tutorials. Okay, now back to the actual tutorial. Thank you. For example, instead of dollar template underscore ID equal sign one, two, three, four, five, six, enter the ID of your template and it will always load in the site's header. You can use this method for specific pages only. Just take note of this. This option is only for one template ID. Some optimization plugins can solve this as well. These solutions are relevant if you embed a template or a global widget of Elementor in your header or footer via your theme options. Note that flash of unstyled content can occur when the stretch section feature is used, as this option operates with JS code and flickers may occur during script loading. Flash of unstyled content can also happen if you use large or heavy pictures. In some cases, such as when a section of large images is causing the faux yuk, a quick workaround can be to add an entrance animation, such as fade in, to the specific section that is having the problem. This can easily solve the problem sometimes. Okay, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Uh, if you liked the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And uh, these videos take a lot of time, so if you do appreciate the content, uh, be sure to subscribe and hit that bell so we can reach more people. Uh, thank you. And if you have any comments or questions, leave in the section below and we will get to them as soon as we can. Thank you very much and see you next time. Bye.